Hey guys, my name is Jordan Teachman, and this is my story. I've been living in Kilcoy for 16 years. It's a nice place and a beautiful town. I spend a lot of time riding my bike and fishing, but there's this one little fish that is preventing me from doing the things that I love doing every day. Tilapia. Tilapia. Tell me a bit about them. They're a fish, they're a pest. We're meant to dig a hole and bury them, but they're pretty good eating. Um, with tilapia, if someone finds tilapia, they need to report it to a fisheries management officer. How do I personally take care of them? Yeah. I eat them and then I s*** me up. <laughs> <laughs> but I think there are 10 on the pest scale to the ecosystem in the dam. Well, um, tilapia are, are a pest fish species and they outcompete native fish so they can um, degrade the ecosystem. Uh, that they've got some really some real strengths in terms of they're, they're a mouth brooder, so um, they're, they're young, have got really high survival rates. They can also uh, live in varying conditions, high salinity, low dissolved oxygen, so they really do and they can outcompete native fish. And populations of these species are not consistent, they're not constant, so they fluctuate over time and that's natural. Because they've evolved together, They've kind of built natural checks and balances. So this might be competition for resource, um, predation, and a number of other things. In natural ecosystems, you've got different kinds of species all interacting together. When they get introduced, they do not have these natural checks and balances. So for example, they, don't, they might not have natural predators. Because they haven't had the chance to evolve, they can dominate habitats and can reproduce rapidly and their populations can increase extremely fast in a short amount of time. And this causes stress on the natural ecosystems. So if you've got rapid amounts of this new species, they can dominate habitats, they can consume a lot of the resources and native species sometimes, they can go extinct from this. In the future, I want my kids and my kids' kids to know what natural fishing is. I want them to enjoy their future fishing. Having tilapia around destroys all the natural habitat. After doing some research, I've realised that tilapia are not only harmful to our environment but also to humans. As introduced species, they have certain diseases that us, as Australians, have not been exposed to. I've been trying to educate my community, such as my dad and my neighbours, about the issues that the tilapia pose, but I'm just one little fish.